easy to play. So we might end up playing some console games for a little bit. Some uh, maybe some Gran Turismo. I haven't opened it up yet. Gran Turismo Sport, I think it is. We could also play some Judgment. New game from the Yakuza devs on PS4, so I haven't made a decision. Uh, Judgment might be nice. The reason my controller is not working. There it goes. All right. So. Yeah, this is the best that we do have. We can go to 20. Go to 14. Okay, we'll we'll see what else we got. We actually can't get his meds yet. It's in the next area. Careful out there. So. Do you require assistance, Warren? Yeah, I'm trying to remember where I need to go. Which I think is this way. I need to go back to the left. Okay, good. I don't have any scrap on me. One thing we haven't done is went that way, so let's do that before we go to Creo World. What's that? I can't actually pick it up. Ooh, concussion mo module. Can't 
can't open that yet. That opens later, I think. All right. There's a couple things over here. We got some random scrap. We're going to Creo World, and this is going to be difficult. Just follow the footprints to the center and get ready for a hell of a tour. First, a certified tour guide will meet you there, show you our mind-blowing fabrication technologies, and tend to your every need before escorting you back to Creo World's many wonderful amusement options. Always free to you and your family. Welcome, visitors of Creole World, to the guided tour of our famous Creole production album. Just follow the footprints to the center. I do have to pause the video on uh, oh, my stream there. And get there we next go. Stop, Creo World. We hope you enjoy your Good. visit. A certified tour. So you might be asking why we're doing Creo World when I said we weren't going to do it right now. Well. To open this uh, milk. So, Creo World has two parts to it. And some good armor, is what I've been told. So, we need to do Creo World, as at least the first part. Has been initiated. We apologize for any inconvenience. Please do not exit the train until help arrives. Oh, you got jokes. A rescue squad has been dispatched. Please follow the instructions of the rescue squad chief and thank you for your patience. Probably have to get that later. Something probably opens up above me. Hello, transmission incoming. Hey, hey, you! I can see you. I just hacked into this drone. Um, please, I need. Thank God, found someone else okay. who hasn't gone insane like everyone else around here. Um, welcome to Creo World. I guess. Jesus. This place definitely isn't as family friendly as it used to be, huh? <laughs> Look, I, I really could use your help. There's a mobile operations center perched on the edge of the sinkhole. You can't miss it. Okay. It'll definitely be a day I won't for Oh look at the little parade. A little mascots. I'm gonna steal your head today, son. Must be above me. Ah. Uh. Hey, hey, folks. Welcome to Creo World. Why don't you come on in? Families are welcome. Fun is guaranteed. And hey, you might just learn a little something, too. That's Creo's pro. Uh-huh. Really? Okay. Sorry, folks. Creo World is closed while we clean and repair America's favorite family. Whoa, what the hell is that? To... Danger. Danger. System malfunction. Containment error code 0x80. Oh! Jesus! F. System reset imminent. Evacuation procedures in effect. Danger. Give me y'all weapon.
Give me your head. Give me all head. Okay, we need to go in this thing. Oh, you probably have to go down, go upstairs and fall down. I'm glad you made it. My name's Largo. It's good to meet you. I'm the operator of the park's search and rescue unit. Nobody can tell me what's going on around here. Maybe you can. Some kind of big energy surge fried my team's chopper and we fell right out of the sky. I haven't been able to raise any of the Moncom since the crash. And now? Everything is gone insane. The park's mega support pillar collapsed, the systems are damaged or out of control. <laughs> this is apocalypse level shit. But... There might be survivors out there, and if my team's looking for them, they'll be depending on me to get these systems up and running again. I'm their eyes and ears. Look, I could really use some feet on the ground right now. So what are you doing here? Me? I'm just a software engineer running support for my team. They're the real heroes, out there saving lives. My skill set is pretty limited to keyboards and repairing Creo hardware. I mean... I always used to joke that I'm the last person you'd want around in an apocalypse. Funny, right? <laughs> Suddenly, not so much. Kind of a shaky situation you're in here. What happened? Our team was on a normal flight patrol when the controls all blew out at once. The chopper was falling fast. I pulled the emergency release on the mobile ops station, like you're supposed to do when things go bad. Oh, I thought I was a goner, but I got lucky. Must have been flying low over the ridge. When I woke up, I found the ops lab where it landed, here, perfectly balanced. What happened to the rest of your search and rescue team? That's what I want to find out. I can't give up on them, no matter the odds. Rodriguez, Nordberg, Eastwood, Helvig, all of them. They're good men with families. I've got a contact ping on loop since I got the station's comms working, but no one's answering. I'm just trying not to assume the worst, you know? I can help. Just tell me what to do. Thanks. Uh, let me do a quick system check. Power's still out all over the park. Ops is running on emergency batteries only. And not for long. First things first, we need to get this place fully operational. Now, let me check the network. Nope. Nada. No dice. We're completely offline. Without network access, I can't do diddly squat from here. All right, so how can I help with the network? See, the problem with the whole network being out is there's no way to run a damn diagnostic, is there? The park's primary server is located, I think, in the Project Resolve Center. You should be able to see the place from outside ops, if it hasn't fallen into the abyss. If you can get there, I might be able to hardwire into it through your rig. 
And if it's not totally fried, I may be able to do some magic. So how do I restore power to the park? My best guess is that whatever happened out there physically damaged the power source itself. See if you can track down the problem and then find uh, some way to... All right, fine. Just walk away while I'm explaining things. No, I, I get it. Got things to do. I do. Whoa, steady there, guy in the big heavy rig. We're kind of a bit on edge here. You know what I mean? <laughs> okay, one of them's right there. Okay, I think I got everything in the yoga, right? Leg, head, body, arm, okay. Is that the way you have to go in this? like the Project Resolve Center. Now, um, try to find the main server room. Wow, okay. I'm gonna pull my headphone a little bit, it's kind of crackling in my ear. He gives a thumbs up, that's funny.
Whoa, 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 whoa. Hold on. Okay. Coming through here. My microphone, let's see if that works. Huh, it's not coming in. That's strange. Okay. Oh, now OBS isn't picking up audio. It's only in my headphones, which is weird. No, let me uh let me actually restart the stream here and see if that fixes it. I might have to restart my computer. Is it just randomly started doing this? So let me restart my computer here. Well, damn, my overlays won't actually go through because, well, I won't have my stream deck plugged into that. Okay. I'm going to have to do something about that. So yeah, I'll be back in just a minute. I'm going to start, I'm going to stop and restart the stream here. See if that helps. <laughs> 